what is a neighbourhood plan? Uh, South Cam's uh, council defined a neighbourhood plan as a, a way for communities to take a proactive approach in deciding the future of the places where they live and work. It is not a legal requirement, but a right which communities can use to determine the development and use of land and to make other improvements to their neighbourhoods, including the development of homes, shops, offices, infrastructure and their design. This can be done through a neighbourhood plan or a neighbourhood development order, which is a baby neighbourhood plan. How does it affect me? Well, anyone living or working in Water Beach may be affected by future changes. The neighbourhood plan is an opportunity to have your views considered. Uh, and before becoming adopted, the neighbourhood plan will be consulted on wildly, widely, wildly, examined by an independent examiner and will need to be approved by residents within the plan area at a local referendum, which we are getting close to now. I'd just like to mention though, um, community infrastructure levy or SIL. Um, one benefit of doing a neighbourhood plan is, is you get greater access to SIL contributions. Uh, we, you should get 25% rather than 15%. What is SIL? Community infrastructure levy is a new levy that local authorities can charge on developments in their area, not only to encourage local development, but also to make sure that the infrastructure in the region can afford to keep up with the new homes and businesses. SIL is pay payable on permitted development as well as planning permission development when the development is commenced. It is basically a replacement for S106 and it is intended to contribute to the provision of infrastructure improvements needed to offset the impact of developments. Uh, sadly, South Cams didn't manage to uh, introduce a, um, a seal contributions within when they adopted their local plan and therefore we're currently not able to uh, take advantage of the, those uh, contributions. <laughs> Do you mean the old local plan? Ryan? No, no, this one. No, you're currently adopted the uh, local plan. Okay, do carry uh, on. What about shaping the future of the village? <coughs> Excuse me, our vision the, uh, our neighbourhood area will continue to be a great place to live and work by ensuring that the identity and character of the existing communities within the parish are respected and protected. The plan will ensure that any new development in the neighbourhood area will provide sustainable infrastructure. It will ensure the improvement of the overall quality of life for every resident. <coughs> new development should not be overbearing or overwhelming and should com complement the rural vistas and the existing Fen Edge landscape. Key dates of our, our current plan, we kicked off in 2015 when the neighbourhood plan, uh, neighbourhood area designate was designated, with the, uh, which was the whole of the parish. Uh, Pre-submission uh, public consultation, oh sorry, following that uh, was a, a, a lot of information gathering for, for several years on, on various uh, methods, uh, using SurveyMonkey, uh, workshops, paper surveys, which were, they were delivered back into the shop so to be collected and counted. Uh, stores on feast day to meet with locals to, and find out their uh, issues and identifying the village concerns and their priorities for uh, improving them. Mm -hmm. Following that went to pre-submission public consultation 14 in uh, January to February 2020. Neighbourhood plan was submitted uh, 2nd of February 2021. The submission public consultation, Regulation 16, uh, 16th of February to 20th of April 2021. And the neighbourhood plan, which was a mass, big milestone, was uh, sent for examination on the 10th of May. This plan was then looked at by this independent uh, examiner who uh, pulled it to pieces basically and sent, uh, asked us several questions, wanted some changes which were agreed with South Cams and we now have 
a copy, uh, a, a version of the plan which is fit to go to referendum. This will be the 3rd of March, which is tomorrow. tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, so please, uh, any residents listening, please get out there and uh, exercise your right to uh, vote on that. Uh, following that, assuming we get a, uh, a referendum is successful, the neighbourhood plan should be made by South Camden District Council at a meeting on the 23rd of March 2022. And Brian, how can people um, take part in the referendum? Sorry? How can people take part in the referendum? Well, people will have been given their voting, their poll cards and invited to go to the local um, polling station at the uh, Salvation Army. Okay, so, and the time that the Salvation Army is open? It's from seven in the morning till 10 at night. Brilliant. So that's when people can start to um, vote for the referendum. Yeah, as, as, as usual. Yeah, thank uh, you. So basically, please, if you live in Water Beach, please vote. Lovely. Thank you very much indeed, Brian.